Hello, welcome to another Mad Hatter review. Uh, my voice is a little crunchy today. I don't know, I, I, I was out last night. I feel like I'm getting sick, okay? I hope not, all right? Fucking speedster out there. Uh, Cheesecake Factory, I went over there. I got a delicious, decadent s'mores cheesecake, okay? So I'm feeling pretty fat now because I ate that whole thing. Not the whole cheesecake, you know, the slice. But uh, anyway... <laughs> I wanted to make this a um, Ninja Tur Turtle Tuesday slash Thundercats Tuesday, okay? They're both keywords, why not? Uh, first thing I want to talk about is the Ninja Turtles portal, of course. It went up. I did a community post on it, but let's just talk about it. So, the uh, Donatello Portable Portal Generator is up on the NECA store right now. It's $44.99, and uh, it's going to be up for three weeks, okay? So, you got some time, all right? You want to maybe wait until March carries over put it on your credit card that means you don't have to pay it until april that's some smart thinking right there or you big baller put your nuts on the table you just get it and pay for it now okay uh either way uh you can get it right now 44.99 uh i will say this uh there's been a lot of talk about the pricing i do think this is overpriced okay this should have been like this is an accessory it's a big accessory it's cool but it's an accessory nonetheless I don't know, should have been like 30 bucks, I think, 35, okay, it's 45, and then you add on a nice $15 shipping, which fucking sucks, of course, um, and how many, in terms of quantity, I mean, you can get as many as you want, maybe you can split the shipping with some friends or something like that, sometimes I do that, but it is overpriced, and I know there are some people that uh, have messaged me saying that they're out at that price, uh, I'm of course going to go in, because... I love the way this portal looks, okay? Um, typically, when things are overpriced, I kind of just make a decision within my own head, okay? Uh, keep in mind that I'm sick in the head and I like to collect and, you know, I, I if I see something I love, I just got to have it. But <laughs> I do, there is a little bit of a reconciliation that I do in my brain um, when something is expensive. I say, how much do I want it, okay? Three months down the line, would I rather have this uh portal in my layer or would i rather have the extra ten dollars or fifteen dollars that i could have had okay for me for me that's an easy answer i'd rather have the portal so i'm going to go ahead and get the portal okay there is there is a a number though obviously that you where you get to and you, you feel uncomfortable okay uh but uh it's okay to think this is overpriced and to still want to get it, okay? I know a lot of sneakerheads, they pay 300, hundreds of dollars for shit that I look at and I'm like, I wouldn't pay 50 bucks for that. So really it's in, it's in, what is it? The eye of the beholder. That being said, this will have diminishing returns, okay? Because there are a lot of people that will say, fuck this, I don't want to get it. So you can't just go crazy with the price uh, because you'll appeal to those that got to have it and uh, eventually rules of attrition it'll start to wear down and people might just uh bail so this does end up um uh biting you in the ass if you do this too much i do think that this is overpriced okay uh do i still want it yes and uh that's it i know there's a lot of and then there's a school of thought of people are like well i'm not gonna pay for this because i'm not gonna justify you know neca's uh behavior i'm not gonna validate neca's behavior and i can see that too okay me, myself, I'm not a fucking activist, okay? <laughs> I, I just get the stuff that I want to get, okay? Uh, I want to get this portal. 45 sucks. I wish it was 30 or 35, but it's not, you know, it's not $100, so fuck it. So that's all I got to say about that. I know there's, um, uh, there's a lot of discussion about this stuff, and some people go, you're right, and some people go, you're wrong. There's no right or wrong. It's your opinion by whatever the fuck you want. So uh, that being said, uh, uh, I did get this portal uh the donatello portal and uh yeah we'll review it when it comes in here i can't wait for this um and that's it i think that's it for the uh portal so again 45 bucks if you want it it's gonna be up my fucking throat is killing me it's gonna be up uh for another three weeks you got three weeks and uh that's it for that and then i wanted to discuss the thundercats okay super seven thundercats because super seven has just done uh, what I was hoping they would do, they came out with a pretty cool fucking wave, okay? Now, these are renders, all right? You know how the Super 7 game works, okay? Renders does not mean this is the way it comes, but 
Uh, I'm very, very, very happy with these choices. A lot of fan favorites. And uh, the first Lunatech. I've been asking for this since wave one. I was like, please, please put in a Lunatech. I gotta have it. So here we go. Uh, let's just go through it right here. Uh, the first thing is, uh, let's just talk about Wily Kid, okay? So uh, if you know or you don't know, uh, there are Thunder Kittens out there, but they are the Mattel versions. Uh, I have one right here. I thought I, I, I'd bring it out. So um, this Wily Kid and Wily Cat, you could only get uh, in the... Um, it was like a Comic-Con exclusive, okay? So technically, there are people that have all the Thundercats sans snarf, but uh, they are releasing another one. And um, I actually like the renders on this one more in terms of the face. I like her face more than this one. This one, I don't know, like, uh, I always felt her eyes were just too, um, just too wide. Something I didn't, I never loved about this face. But these are just renders, okay? So who the hell knows? This might come out, <laughs> this, this might suck, all right? But uh, the renders look really good. And it does come with two heads, which the other one did not, I don't think. I think this was the only head. Um, so you got Smiling Wily Kit. And then you have uh, you have uh, uh, um, uh, Winking Wily Kit. And then there are some other differences. So like the lasso is red here. This one was pink. And then the board is different. You can take a look at this board. It's all it's thinner and doesn't have like the line in the yellow. This one does. And also this uh, the render has a better base. It's got like a smoke on the base. This one's sans smoke so probably go in for a new wily kid if it's cool okay uh by the way i didn't notice this too they have uh these pre-orders are 15 percent off now okay pre-order 15 percent off wave eight set of four uh they've never done that before as far as i know they've never uh, and and in fact a lot of their thundercats are 15 percent off in stock actually all of them so that says to me that super seven is getting the memo that their stuff might be a wee bit overpriced, <laughs> it seems. So um, I just thought that that was interesting. Let's move on here to Hachiman. Okay, Hachiman was the first guy previewed. Uh, he looks great. His renders look great. His face looks great. But remember, remember Super 7 in human faces, okay? Remember, remember this day in November. I think that's the phrase. Uh, so Hachiman looks awesome. I love his armor. Um, he has the hand that can balance the uh, lightning thunder cutter. And he has uh, the, the regular no lightning and the scabbard and the hands and um, uh, the belt. One thing I don't love is it's not like a removable helmet, okay? It, you have an alternate helmet head with the gritting, uh, gritty teeth. What if I just want the stern face in the helmet head, okay? Uh, it doesn't look like I can just pop that off and put it on there, which I don't like, okay? I, maybe that was done. Maybe the headband is, is fucking with them. I don't know, but like I would have loved just to have the helmet on a stern head. I rarely, rarely like gritting teeth. Uh, it it, it, it uh, doesn't translate that well into anything but Ninja Turtles. Ninja Turtles with the gritting teeth, uh, they do it well. Uh, but uh, just humans don't seem to do that face well. I, I, I rarely see it translate to action figure form in a way that I like. Uh, so uh, just, just uh, keep that in mind. Uh, next up. Captain Shiner, Captain Shiner, uh, this was, um, I love this guy as a kid, first thing I know, well, let's just go through, so he's got three heads, okay, I don't know if he needed the three heads, but he's got screaming head, gritting head, and, uh, just regular face, and then he's got, uh, you know, his outfit, his sleek black outfit, he has the, his gun, all his, him and all his guys, uh, use those, uh, those guns, some handcuffs, and uh, that's really cool. It's like a wrapped sort of omens. <laughs> this accessory I thought was funny is he's got a crossing arms accessory, okay? <laughs> Super 7 pretty much admitting that they're very, very limited with their articulation. Although crossing arms is hard in general uh, for, I mean, even NECA figures, I don't think can cross arms. Crossing arms, you're talking about like Mafex, Marvel Legends maybe. But uh, you can pull his arms off. You get a nice crossing arm configuration i wish that chitara came with running legs i pop her uh, legs off and then i could just put running legs on there so if we're talking about taking off limbs why not do that um i am disappointed captain shiner didn't come with his uh, big red gun he had uh, in the old um in the old uh, ljn toy 
Uh, he had that big uh, uh, red gun that he came with. Why, why would that not come with this? I don't know. Like, I know that these are supposed to be... Ba maybe I just answered my own question based off of the... Um, uh, the cartoon and less the toy, but uh, come on, are they going to really make like a toy version Captain Shiner? I don't know. Maybe they will. Maybe that's the thought process. But uh, yeah, no big fucking red gun. Uh, but I do love this character, so hopefully the renders come out uh, okay. And he's got the monocle too, which I like. And then uh, finally, finally, the first lunatic. First lunatic figure ever, groundbreaking right here. And you got Aluro. Uh, Aluro, uh, he's like the hypnotic, uh, 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 lunatic, you know, you, you come up to him and his power's like, you're under my spell, and then all of a sudden you're fucking, you know, just attacking your own, your own teammates, uh, but, uh, so you got Aluro, he looks great, okay, I'm just hoping the renders come, uh, are the, the matching, um, figure comes out like the renders, but uh, you got him, uh, uh, just, uh, teeth smile and then uh he's just kind of like maniacally laughing you got all his creepy hands i think he's gonna be pretty tall uh you got his uh uh his little wand bubble uh weapon thing and then an extra one and then the little box i forgot what that's from and the map and then the little trinket right there comes with a lot of good shit and um he should be tall and i'm very excited i'm now hoping Please, please let them just complete the lunatics because by my math, you got five of these, which means you need five more waves to, to, to complete that. If they only make one or two of them before this line dies, I'm going to fucking go crazy and take a lot of innocent people with me. So uh, I'm hoping that that is um, that that does uh, come out and uh, he does look pretty fucking tall. So hopefully, hopefully these come out good. Please, please, Super 7, just... Uh, just, just paint your paint game. Just up it. I'm, I'm just hoping new factory, this and that. Just, just come on, okay? Because I gotta have some fucking lunatics. Uh, that's it. That's it for Turtle Tuesday slash Thundercats Tuesday. My throat's killing me. I'm gonna go fucking uh, suck on a lemon or something. And uh, more news as we got it. More reviews. Uh, I think I got a review coming up this week. And uh, that is all I got. Let me know what you guys think about this. Uh, did you go in for the portal? Uh, remember, you got three weeks, okay? That's more than a, a fortnight. Comment, subscribe, drop me a like. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.